Welcome back to the 11th tutorial of MS Project and this might be the last tutorial of MS Project in which we are going to learn about the reporting in MS Project that how we have to create the reports, the visual reports and the tabular reports and how you have to present them to your clients and to your uh, any person who is uh, uh, involved in the project and you just want to show them a summary of your resources and the critical tasks and all the things which are um, uh, you can say required at that time of the meeting. So let's see that how to report uh, the further options. First of all, you have to go to this reporting tab and you can see here select a view or report. You can click here and say display or analyze project, create a project report. In this you can see calendar, Gantt chart, Gantt chart, detailed Gantt chart and when you see Gantt chart apply this view, all the Gantt chart is in front of you. But I'm not going to use this one uh, because this I have a, a pretty easy uh, option of reporting as compared to this one. So to use those options, go have to go to reports, reports menu, which is available here. You just have to click here, and you can see there are two options: visual reports and reports. So if you go to the visual reports option, option which is the first one, now the visual reports option is going to allow you that. You can export the data on Microsoft Office and Microsoft Visio. And since this both are of Microsoft, Microsoft Project and Microsoft Office Excel, so they are both compatible. And you can make the graphs up a two or files when I share kar sakte So better ye hai ki aap log ke paas version same ho. Agar aapke paas Microsoft Office Excel ka version same hai or Microsoft Project ka version same hai to aapki ye files sari ke sari uh, Excel ke andar export ho jayengi aur wahan pe automatically graphs ban jayenge jaise ye cash flow report aap dekhna chahte hain you just have to click here on the cash cash flow re report and you can just click on view when you will click on view this says that you have Excel 2003 or later installed on your computer because my MS Project version is different and my Microsoft Office uh, Excel version is different. So for those who have the same version, after that the files on this diagram will be generated in Microsoft Excel then Microsoft Excel will be opened in front of you and you can edit the graphs. So you have a bane bane automatic graphs aajate, to aap uske play kar sakte hai. Since there are many tabs, task usage, cash flow report, resources usage, pie charts bhi aap bana sakte hai. Assignment usage, assignment summary, resource summary, task summary, and all you can play with this. There are a lot of options in which you can generate the visual reports. So, one by one, you can check them and report them, and accordingly, the one which you like and which you think is most suitable for you, up for use. Kar sakte. So, the second option I find it very informative is the tabular reports. When you click on this report option, you can see different further options, six further options, overview, current activities, costs, assignments, workload and custom. So let's see them one by one. When you click on overview, click on select and you can see a project summary, click on select again and a project summary is displayed in front of you. So this is a very good option that it generates automatic reports in front of you. Now, if you want to see the current activities, jo activities aapki is worker use or hai. So, unstarted tasks, tasks starting soon, tasks in progress. So, let's say the tasks in progress, completed tasks, should have started tasks, slipping tasks, select. And you can see these tasks are in front of you. Tasks in progress as of Sunday 5 3 20 project 1. So, labor measure and these are the resources and this is the task name lean concreting is uh, the task which is in progress and these are the resources which is lean concreting and second one is curing of lean concrete so you can see very easy is that you don't have to do anything again a very good thing by ms project this is return page one of two you click here and you can see the second page and also the cost is mentioned as well 27,850 rupees so again it's a very good thing 
Microsoft project automatically generates these reports and that is a pretty good feature of this MS project again. So if you click on costs, select cash flow. Now cash flow is going to tell you that how much amount of cash is going to be spent on the project and where. Click on select and you can see here since we have not calculated the cost of other activities that's why it is not showing here. This is the date cash flow of Sunday 5320 project 1 and you can see this date 26420 on this date rupees 400 was spent on clearing and grabbing so nothing else so again if you want to see uh, other pages because it is page 1 of 8 any other page yes this one we are having 200 rupees on layout excavation 600 rupees and 1000 rupees now lean good reading is we are spending 27,850 rupees then steel reinforcement 800 and you can see a very good summary total amount is also calculated here aap asani ke saath automatically tarike se check kar sakte hain ki kitne paise aapke kahan pe kharch ho rahe hain kis din mein kaun si activity ke upar very good feature that how much amount is going to be spent on which activity on which day again i am going to select on assignments who does what when who does what to do list let's say who does what when it, it is going to tell you which person is performing how much of its time on one day let's say labor is spending four hours total clearing and grabbing on this date 29 4 this labor is just using four hours only the rest of the four hours are free Baki ke char ghente, wo koi kaam nahi kar so being the from the contractors point of view you can easily see that how much of your resources are being wasted aap apne resources ko utilize kar sakte hain ke ji ye 4 ghante aapka labor kaam kar raha hai to how why not i i am paying it for the 8 hours then why not i am using it for the 8 hours so you can easily see how much persons are going to be working on which day and how much uh, further hours you can utilize aap us tarah unki efficiency increase kar sakte hain aur apne paise bacha sakte hain again very good thing workload click select resource usage task usage let's see task usage again clearing and grabbing labor 4 hours just going back workload resource usage select again resources are shown to you so in this way uh, you can generate automatic the um, reports and you can also uh, generate a customized report for which you have to click on this custom option click select and this is the further options earned value analysis you can also perform for those who know what is earned value from those who are in the field of the project management unko pata ki earned value analysis kya hota critical tasks you want to see okay fine preview and you can see all the critical tasks here very easy the days, the starting time, the finishing time, the predecessor, the percentage complete and it is going to summarize it in a very beautiful tabular form. Now you can print it, export it. So these are all the options that you can play with. You can see the same option who does what when available here as well. So you can play with options ke saath khel sakte hain. You can play with them one by one. You can see them and this um, includes our this concludes the tutorial of the MS project we have uh, started from the very basics and we have finished up to the reports how to enter the task how to enter the resources how to link the resources with the tasks how to track the progress of the project and finally how to report the project so if you find any difficulty in anything you can always comment and ask questions in the comments and I will be, uh, uh, of course, I will be replying to you. So, thank you. Keep on watching the next tutorials uh, I'm going to be uh, making on some other softwares which are very useful. We'll be announcing soon. So, share the videos. Keep on liking. Thank you. Allah Hafiz.